What the fuck happened here last night? Good afternoon guys, welcome to another vlog. We're currently gonna do a hotel room tour. We're gonna stay back in the Arroyo down the harbor. Um, firstly, I need to go something. Welcome to another food review. We're gonna test, we're gonna try the pizza from Rice's. I ordered the chicken prepared in our guys. <laughs> this is my lunch and dinner. So we're gonna get a try. Uh, as I read on the title, we should quite big. Hmm, not bad. Do you think that you're interested about Monday and Tuesday, the Rice's here in Dalian Harbour? Um, they got a discount for the pasta and the pizza. Drop almost half price from 24 to 10 or 10, 12 dollars. And actually, the rushes are pretty nice. It's uh, one of my favorites here in Sydney, Dalian Harbour. Okay, guys. Uh, as I said before, so we're gonna stay today in the in the Pablo Sydney Dalian Harbour. We're gonna do the hotel room tour. The reason I'm gonna stay here today is because uh, the hotel is reopened the doors after all this uh, lockdown of this pandemic for almost 20 months. So uh, they decided to open the doors um, on the first of the December. So from one week from today, um, we're gonna open the, to the public. So I got invited to stay there for one night with breakfast included. So let's see, we're gonna do a little bit of room tour. We're gonna have a couple of drinks. I'm gonna have a lot of fun. So it's great. I'm getting dark now. It's almost 8.40. I was just getting my lunch and dinner because I was pretty busy today and work. So let's go. So check-in is done. Uh, I didn't show you the lobby because it's always guests there. You know, you don't want to try to avoid any issues with the guests. So these are the corridors. Big space. I think each floor got 38 rooms. Uh, let me give you a little bit more information on this hotel. It has um, 10 floors. And we stay in room number 532. It's a corner room located between bathrooms and the history of the hotel. So it's a pretty nice room. Just give me one sec, I'll show you in two seconds. Okay guys, so this one was a kind of imitation. Just don't worry, I wasn't using the bathroom at all. I put the bathroom because I was, it's kind of a little bit raining outside there. So I get a little bit wet and then just to change, so I don't know, maybe make it a little bit fun. All right guys, so as I said before, this one is uh, 10 stores. Hotel location is really good. It's right in the middle of the city, five minutes away from Downey Harbor, uh, five minutes away from Chinatown. Chinatown is about two minutes walking from here, walking distance, circular key, 
Opera House, The Rocks, all that area with this, about 20 minutes walking. You can also take the train uh, down the harbor just across the street. It's a very good location, guys. So I'm in level five, room number 532. Uh, size of the ruin is five, 32 square meters, if you're not wrong. It's a corner ruin, so this ruin in particular looks a little bit different because it's a corner ruin, that's why. Anyway, you know the drill, guys. We start from the main entry and show you things like that. So as soon as you open the door, okay, you got the luggage rack. And over here, the seat, so you can relax. Over here on the right hand side, you got the bed. It's a king size, beautiful with the four pillars, nice one. So this is your side from here to here is your missus side. Obviously like this guys, that's the rule. You can't complain, you better shut up and that's it. So this is your working desk, your working area. Beautiful, mm -hmm. a telephone, no pad, this land. And we got the standing land, nice. Look at the size of the room, beautiful. Okay, and then we got the TV. I think probably about 55, since, yeah, 55 inches probably. Uh, that section here. The, we got the fridge. Of course, I got a couple of things that I bought already. So everything ready for tonight. Water, alcohol, beautiful. <laughs> and in the middle, cupboard, we got the tea as usual and tea, coffee, and sugar, all the etc etc and then we got the glasses and the coffee cups and the internet cable international adapter very interesting very popular very important if you're coming from overseas of course we got the kettle and then what else we can show you ah here so about the mess guys of course we got the clock and this one i believe is a connecting door so in case you're sharing the room with someone else i mean if you come with a big family so can come in coming through Okay, with the cupboard, the cupboard in here, we got some uh, hangers. This is my t-shirt. We got the uh, bathrobes. Uh, we got the iron, very important because we're gonna do some ironing. Of course, the hair dryer and then the safe, very important in case you know put the passport or anything to value. We got some luggage rack and the iron book cover. Okay, moving forward over here, we got the bathroom. This bathroom is quite big. Okay, so we got. On the left, we got the bathtub, nice. I think maybe, uh, maybe I'll, I'll probably I uh, will fit there nicely, but two people, if it's not size, I don't think so, I'm a really big guy. But average people, two, we might fit in there. Uh, okay, toilet, nice. Uh, two toilet rolls, couple set of towels, the shower, nice, big space. There you go. Okay, and over here we have the bathroom area, the, uh, what's it called, the bathroom glass, and uh, the face washes, and of course the amenities, and look at the size of this mirror, so one for you, one for your mates, that's always the rule, no the hotel rooms got two here two hand basins, I think the corner rooms got the two, or and the suite rooms, I'm not 100% sure, but I think that's the thing. Okay, and the view on the left, it's a city view, guys. So that's Dali Harbor. This one here is uh, Batu Street. And on the top two blocks up, it is Tanho, so Sussex, Ken, Joe Street. And then on this one here, and over here, so uh, if you cross the bridge outside the hotel, you, you will get ended up in uh, Dali Harbor. That's the new hotel they come in. Exhibition Convention Center. Chinatown, Paris Market over there. Uh, Barangaroo is on um, that side. And then, uh, yeah, so um, this hotel in particular got two restaurants. Uh, one is for breakfast, located in Level La called Baker's. And that's where we do get, you get your breakfast service. And then for lunch and dinner time, uh, for lunch, sorry, for, that, for, lunch, for lunch and dinner, it's uh, called downstairs outside of the lobby. It's called Above. Uh, it's also a bar, a um, very nice hotel. If we uh, get a chance, I will make, maybe take some photos and I'll show you on the end of the video. Uh, level one, you got the gym, some rooms, and you got conference rooms as well. In level up where the restaurant is, also you got conference rooms. And uh, 10 floors, there's no swimming pool on the hotel, unfortunately, but there is a swimming pool about five minutes walking from here. I call the aquatic, 
St. Uh, something like that. Or you can go to Kuji Beach or Bondi Beach. It's about half an hour away from here. You can take the light rail or, and then get off in Randwick or take the Uber or take the bus. That's not a big deal. Um, plenty options for dining in the Dining Harbor in case you don't want to eat in the restaurant. Uh, Paris Market so five minutes away from here. Oh, food is, this, as, as I said, this hotel is a really good location. Food is the last thing you need to worry about it. And then transport very easy to come. It's about, from here to the airport, it's about 20 minutes. Uh, no, but train, I think 10 to 15 minutes if it's domestic, 20 minutes if it's international. You can take Uber, you can take train. It's really nice, it's really close. So it's a really good location, the hotel. What else I can say? And I'm just gonna stay tonight, one night, tomorrow go for breakfast. As I say, I try to fill the breakfast, the restaurant. But uh, if some, if there's a lot of people having breakfast, so I, I don't think so. I will feel because I don't want to uh, boring, um, get someone in inconvenience, you know, privacy of the guests. And then, uh, yeah, it's a nice hotel. I stay here already a few times. Today is the uh, reopening. And then uh, let's see how we're going. Anyway, other guys, I'll see you next time. And thank you. And uh, have a great weekend. Take a trip on it. It's a beautiful day today. Thursday, raining day. What a shitty day. Look, look. Rotation, figure it's in just season. Shine bright.